Good morning, GC. It is Monday, January 8th. I'm Dennis Mars. And I'm Caden Gregory. Let's get into today's announcements. Time is running out to get a senior yearbook ad. Share this information with your parents, grandparents, and guardians. The deadline to purchase a senior salute is January 26th. You can scan this QR code to get the form. Pause this video if you need to see Miss Mason in the library if you have any questions. Graves County will have a new head football coach starting tomorrow. The announcement will be made during SOAR in the Independence Bank Performing Arts Center. Assistant Principal Lance Gregory served as interim head coach for the 2023 season. We'll let you know who the new head coach is after the announcement. Keep an eye on our Instagram. There are new SOAR goals for this second semester. They are focused on cutting down the number of referrals. Each grade level has different, a different goal. If they meet these goals, everyone gets popcorn and drinks. Let's look at the goal for the freshmen. They need to have no more than 250 write-ups in the third nine weeks. As of this morning, freshmen already have 21. Sophomores need to have no more than 80 write-ups in the third nine weeks to get the reward. As of right now, they have 10. For juniors, you need no more than 65 write-ups in the third nine weeks. Right now, you have a total of eight. For seniors, you need to have no more than 25 write-ups in the third nine weeks. Right now, seniors only have two. All of these goals were chosen based on the number of write-ups each grade level has, all, has so far. Some DECA students are working to help kids with disabilities enjoy the sport of baseball. The Miracle League is a nonprofit organization that helps kids overcome obstacles to play baseball. They're looking for new buddies to help with this project. There will be an informational meeting on January 31st during SOAR in the library. Be there if you're interested. Talk to Ellie Clark if you need more information before that meeting. Seniors, the window for this year's FAFSA is open. This is the form for federal student aid if you plan to attend college. This can be a com complicated process. That's why the Kentucky Higher Education Assistance Authority put together a video to guide on filling out the forms. We're going to include a link to that video in the description of this video. Check it out if you need help filling out the FAFSA. It's worth your time and it could get you a lot of money for college. There are still several students that need to talk to Ms. Duke about attendance. This list is for students that have several unexcused absences. That list has been emailed to teachers. You need to let your SOAR students know if they are on that list. Ms. Duke will be at the blue table near the front office every day during lunches. Seniors, do you know someone who would like to have one of these signs to celebrate your graduation? Senior yard signs are now on sale. Here's what you need to know. Signs are $25 each. You can pick up an order form at the blue, at the blue desk by the front office. Those forms and payment must be turned into Ms. Sausman or Ms. Smith by January 12th. They accept cash or checks. The last day to order senior signs is January 12th as well. Lunch for today is grilled cheese sandwich with potato soup. Sides include carrots, celery, curly fries, side salads, apples, and oranges, and oranges and sandwiches fixings. Now to Mayfield's father with today's weather. Hey GC, it's Lucas back with your three-day forecast. There's rain chances all day today. The wind is going to pick up this afternoon. The high today is 49 and the low is 41. That rain isn't going away until tomorrow afternoon. It will be a little warmer with a high of 51, but you'll still need that rain jacket. Wednesday will be partly cloudy with a high of 46. There's a chance for some winter weather this weekend. We'll talk more about that later this week. Now on to Dalton with Sports. Hey GC, it's Dalton Bell with sports. They may have beaten us in football, but our basketball teams are showing their dominance against Mayfield. Both the boys and girls won in a doubleheader at Mayfield Friday night. The boys are now 11-3 and the girls are 7-8. Both teams will be back in action tomorrow night here against Paducah Tillman. Help us pack the student section. Bowling will be in Massac County tomorrow night at the Super Bowl. Good luck to them. And a quick shout out to Mr. Miller and Mr. Kendall. Their team has won the championship in both of the Fantasy Solar Leagues. Mr. Kendall defeated Coach Hargrove in the final, and Mr. Miller defeated his wife in the final. Thanks, Matt Bell, for the sports update. That's all for today's news. I'm Caden Gregory. And I'm Dennis Mars.